Hi everybody, it's Feb. I'm at Dragonbridge Manor today and this is our very own Dragonbridge. I'll show you where we are on the map. We're actually just outside of the town. There's Dragonbridge and we're here and you can fast travel here straight away. It appears on the map. It's free. There's no quest, no purchase price at the moment I should say because it is a work in progress. And this is the home. It looks pretty imposing. And it's on three levels. It's not actually as massive as it looks. Um, I was surprised when I got in there. I mean, don't get me wrong, it's still pretty big. All right, so as you come in down here in the basement, this, I guess you would call your staff quarters. Uh, there are guards around the estate. What do you need? And they seem to be housed in here. They've all got their own little fires, which is nice. I'll come back to that doorway in a minute because it's a bit of an oddity. And then more staff beds. And whoever gets this huge room just gets bedrolls in the corner. <laughs> but they have their own bar. And that's it for that level. And then you come up to what I guess is your workroom and library. And the models that made me laugh, mm -hmm. the books are awesome. Enchanting sales, enchanting to riches. I think that's riches or richness, mm -hmm. one or the other. Enchanting underwear. <laughs> I was like, what? As yes. I was reading these books. Uh, Mythic Dawn commentary, some nice books here. Yes. And your Enchanter and Alchemy Lab. Look at the Alchemy Lab. Gaji. That's pretty fab, isn't it? What do you need? Potions logbook. Digest information, a shepherd's guide to alchemy. So this is a, a sweet little thing. Sink into curious candy making. Read carefully how to tame a daedra. Hold the book correctly. Dummy guide to Mass Effect 3. So yeah, that is that is neat. A bit of fun. And lots of decoration on these shelves. And a few shrines too. Need something? Yes. Oh my god. <sighs> no, I don't need anything. <laughs> so, a really nice kids' room. They've all got their own little bedside tables and chests. A few toys to play with. That is awesome. Look at that. That is quite fab. I would not want to be the child that sleeps in that bed <laughs> with that looking at me. Oh my god. But yeah, this is a really nice kids room and then there's a little empty room just off this. Maybe it'll be a bathroom or something. So that's quite neat and you have these ramps from floor to floor. So up here, some more seating areas and this smashing dining table. You can imagine the whole family sitting down to eat. Wife, six kids, all your indoor staff. Nice cooking pot. I didn't see an oven anywhere. And shed loads of crockery. Which you would probably need for a household this size. Oh, shut up. There's an oven <laughs> right behind me. Oh, my God. And then off of this. Speak. Kajit will listen until all the sugars in the world turn sour. <laughs> and uh, yeah, what was I saying? Your bedroom. That's right. 
which is comfy enough and bug jars kind of safe and that's pretty much it for the structure of the home and it does feel unfinished at the moment doesn't it or it, maybe that's just me there's you know it needs some green it needs some tapestries and pictures and maybe another couple of rugs or something or maybe that that's just my taste I shouldn't impose it on other people <laughs> I'm sorry I'm not a minimalist type of person but it's a beautiful well-lit home and you have the bonus of a little tower Now, when I came through this door, I had a couple of rocks in the way, so I just deleted those. And <laughs> my doorway has gone. See, look, she's just come out, but there's no actual door to get back in there at the moment. But the tower... This one needs something. Yeah. Oh. Come on, chop chop, Zelda. Come on. Yes? <laughs> Stop pushing me off the stairs and move, woman. Need something. There we go. Okay, so it's quite a tall tower and it has amazing views. This is a real feature of this home. Oh, if it was a nice day, you could see for miles. But you get the picture. It's pretty fantastic up here. And what a wonderful addition. I'm so glad that the mod author put this in. Now imagine it with a table and a couple of chairs. And you could just pop up here and read a book. And all this is yours too down there. I tell you what, we'll fast travel back to it just simply because there's no door. <laughs> At the moment. Okay, so this is where it brings you when you fast travel. You've got a really nice walled estate. And look at that. That looks so nice, doesn't it? And there's some cows and chickens. Wood chopping block. And a sky forge. A smelter and a workbench. A couple of chests around. I need to have a I don't know what that is. <laughs> a pointy piece of landscape. <laughs> Just random. And then some practice dummies and targets and a bit of farm up here. Some wheat, and taters, leeks, carrots and cabbage. And there's a few plots. Maybe there'll be more. But that's a nice feature too. And the whole place is lit with like a, a golden glow. Okay, so that's it for the home at the moment. There's the tower. So I will leave it here. Call that the end of the video. And I will see you soon for another.